All right, final tutorial I'm gonna share in this segment is breeds and procedures. And this is really sort of the meat and potatoes of um, getting this to do uh, more than just um, having fun things going around the screen. So procedures are, are a great way of um, defining code that you want to repeat or update. Um, and each procedure has a keyword um, that you use to identify it. And then breeds are a way to have more than one type of turtle on the screen. So this is where you get into the modeling and having different um, objects interact with each other. And so we're going to create uh, breeds of cats and cat, cats and mice. Yes, that's right. And so I've provided a sample um, piece of code. And we're just going to go ahead and copy this all together and then I'll kind of break it down for you. So we're no longer going to be in the command center. We're going to come over here to code and I can just drop that whole thing in here. But let me talk about this. So when you're defining a breed, you have to define its plural and its singular. So you can act on the breed as all of the breed or you can act on individual objects of the breed. So we're going to um, do cats and mice. And then two is a clue. This is a clue that you've got a procedure coming up. So setup is the name of this procedure. And you can see that this is clearing all. Um, it's creating one cat and it's creating 30 mice. So you see with the, for the create, it's using the plural of the breed. And then it's asking the plural of the breed to set its color, to set its shape and to set its size. Um, the same with the mice. So we'll have one cat that is like this and all of the mice will be like this. These are all observer. This is all observer stuff. Then we have another procedure called meow. Again, two is, a, is the sort of clue and it's a command. Meow is something I called it. So you can obviously call that a procedure any name you want. And then again, instead of we're, instead of, uh, working with the turtle command, we're gonna ask the whole breed. So if you're a cat, then you're gonna go forward. If you're a mouse, then you're gonna go forward 10. If you're a cat, then uh, we're gonna have it say meow. And if you're a, a mouse, we're gonna have it say eek. So we can check this before we start. And it seems like we don't have any coding issues. So let's go ahead and try to run it. Um, one thing I want to do is use these buttons again. So I'm going to edit this button and I'm going to, um, if I just write this name in, because we've already called this procedure setup, I can just do that. And for this, I'm going to call meow. Okay, let's see. Uh oh, we have an error. So um, we didn't get an error when we. Uh, check the code, but this is a error because we don't have a shape cat defined. Okay, so the errors um, in this are often pretty good. So we're going to dismiss that. And if you remember, we went up to tools, turtle shape editor, and you could either create a cat, you can also import from the library. And there's a lot more shapes in here. And um, I'm just going to go ahead and import a cat. And I don't think we have mouse either. So I'm going to go ahead and import a mouse as well. Now we've got lots of different shapes of mice. So maybe I'll do mouse top. Now there's going to be another problem with that. I wonder if you can guess what it's going to be. I'm going to go ahead and run it again. So set up. Oh, so even though I got a mouse, it's not called exactly mouse. So programming languages, you have to be very precise. Um, it's not going to intuit that you meant to call it mouse. So I need to edit this and just make sure it's mouse. OK, now let's see if this will work. There we go. Keep moving them. So now you're able to, with these commands of uh, breed and procedures, you're able to do a lot more with um, this. And it's gonna allow us to look at other code 
And even though we might be able to create um, a very sophisticated model at this point, we will be able to use models that others have created and look at the code and have a better idea of what's going on. All right, good luck.